Next is question number B from 10.19 to show the conversion. So here we have ethanol to but 1 ion. So this is the uh, conversion that we need to show. So here we need to have ethanol which is CH3CH2OH and we need to form but 1 ion. So that is this. So from here to here. But if you notice in this, we have 2 carbon here but we have 4 carbon which means almost double. So that means our R group that you are going to take has to be CH3, CH2 and something. Alright, so that is a clue that one of the R group that you are taking has to have a 2 carbon chain to add on to the existing alcohol molecule. Alright, so first what we will do is we will have to prepare that double bond, this uh, 2 carbon chain first. So for that we will take from the molecule ethyne because we need to have this ethyne here. So we will take ethyne. We will add sodamide which is a strong base with liquid ammonia at a particular temperature. Alright. When this happens, this hydrogen here is more acidic in nature. We have learned this in hydrocarbon chapter in first year that the H from the acetylene uh, molecule is more uh, acidic in nature. So here you will have C with a negative charge and Na. So now we have formed one half of the molecule which is a triple bond. This needs to react with a reactant here. So here we will have CH3, CH2OH which is a reactant given to us in the, in the question with CH triple bond with a C minus and an Na plus. Alright, but here we can't do a direct combination because we don't have a reaction where OH is leaving out directly when you do this. So what you will do, let's remove this out. We will not use this again. Now we will use it later. So first what we will do is we are going to show conversion of OH to a halide. So we have as any one chlorination uh, reagent you can take and here you will form CH3, CH2, CF. So now that OH is replaced with the Cl, now you can go ahead and use this uh, triple bonded um, compound. This with CH triple bond with a C minus and Na. This will form. Now the C minus can bond here and this Cl can move out. Now you will end up getting your final compound which is butyne all right so this all these type of reactions you will get a hang over it only once you start practicing them 